Hey Babs, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Davia and today I have a hair unboxing video for you guys. I haven't did an unboxing video for some hair quite a while now because I haven't really been buying any hair. I've been kind of taking a break, letting my regular hair breathe. But I'm back. I got a vacation coming up next week so I had to get me some new weave. And I'm super excited because I've been dying to try this company because I've been seeing it like on Facebook, on Snapchat, on Instagram, like it's just been everywhere. And I was just kind of curious, is it like a hype, you know, you know how people are like, oh, this hair is good, this hair is good, but then it's trash, you know? And so I'm super excited about it to just to see if it is actually about its hype. So yeah, this hair came in yesterday and the hair that I have, it's called love me hair i'm super excited so my bow was broken when it came in like i'm not really gonna worry about that but like it wasn't even attached to the box i was just like oh okay but anywho this is called love me hair i'm pretty sure you guys already heard about it if you did let me know in the comments down below and if you tried it let me know what you guys think so right off rip i'm gonna let you guys know this is not gonna be a video of me customizing this hair I'm just going to kind of put it on my head, let you guys see what it looks like, and that's really it. Um, yeah, because I'm not customizing this wig to like next week before I leave on my vacation. So if you guys want to see that video, let me know in the comments down below and I will do a separate video for that. But just for today in general, I just want you guys to see how it is actually coming out the box for me receiving it. Haven't touched it at all. Nothing. And so let's get into it. And so this is what it looks like in the box. It says... Enjoy your hair journey from now on. Helen, the founder of Love Me Hair. And this is the little package that it comes in. Well, we're going to get to this last. I'm going to show you guys the little goodies that I got because your girl loves goodies. <laughs> but I got some lashes, guys. Look at that. This is a cute little lash case. Got me some little Love Me lashes. And it's a 3D mink. Can't go wrong with it. And got this little goodie pack. I will show you guys what's in there after. Of course, got to have the wig cap, even though it's not my color. But I appreciate the gesture. And then it comes like a little card. Let's see. That tells you about the refund policy. Has a little front, little pamphlet. Let's see what's on the inside. Tells you how to take care of the wig, how to use the wig, and frequently, frequently acts products and usage and that's kind of what it looks like on the inside but that's it for that part let's get into this bag let's see what we got so this is what the little bag looks like it's a love me hair bag i got some goodies i don't know what this is i think it was like that little satin hair wrap that kind of lays the edges down but let's see i seen it on the website it tells you like it tells you what goodies you're gonna get Oh yeah, so it is one of those. So you just kind of put it around your head like that. Keep your head good at night. Well, your lace good at night. So I'm definitely going to be using that. I wish it didn't say. I wish it just would have said love me here instead of affordable luxury wig. But it is what it is. Ain't nobody going to see it with my husband anyway. So who cares? I got me some Barbie pins. A comb. Because I can make my parts. But all right. And then I have an elastic band to make my wig tighter if it's not already tight. Usually it already comes with the elastic band in the bag, but this is just to make it more secure if you have a smaller head like me. But yeah, so that's that and that bag. And then you have some tweezers and a little hairpin, which is so cute. It says, love me. I actually like that. I'm probably going to be rocking that when I go on vacation. But anywho... That's that, what you get in the box. We're going to get into this wig, y'all. Because I'm, I'm like, excited about this wig. Because it's just been looking so good online. Like, I'm looking at it by YouTube. And it's just been looking so good. So, I'm like, is it that good? I can't wait. <laughs> I'm trying to get this back out of the way. It won't move. But this is what it looks like. It has the cap on it. It is an 18-inch wig. I'm going to go ahead and unwrap it. Ah! Well, this part came off. We can go ahead and leave that where it's at. But this is the wig. Oh, why is it stuck to my finger? There we go. So this is what the wig looked like. Oh, also, I did get a full lace wig. This is the reason why I didn't do a customized video in this video is because 
this is going to be my first time ever customizing a full lace wig. And so I have to see how it goes. I'm going to, if I do post a video on it, it'll be like my test and trial video. But I've been watching other people on YouTube to see how they do their full lace wigs because I never had one before. So this will be very interesting. But this is the wig, guys. It is 18 inches. It smells like the regular weave that you will get from anywhere, to be honest. So I don't, it doesn't smell like anything in particular. Like I said, this is a full lace, so you can do a part literally any freaking wear, y'all. Like, I'm so soaked about this. <laughs> like, I hope it lasts a very long time because your girl is soaked about this, y'all. Because I like to put my hair up and everything, so. It looks good. It's a body wave. It looks good so far. I'm going to go ahead and put this on my head. And see how it looked before I do that. So I show, ah, want to show you guys the inside. So it does come with the comb in the middle. Comb on the side. Like I said, it has the elastic band. I don't know why it's connected. I don't know. Did I do that? I don't think I did. But anyhow, let me unconnect this really quick. There we go. So, two combs on the side. One comb in the middle. One comb in the back. So if it's not secure enough, you guys can add your elastic band to it and just kind of sew it in. I usually do mine's like right on the side creases right here just to make it feel a little more secure. But your girl's going to try this wig on to see how it looks, see if it's long enough, see if it's true to length. Let's get into it. Alright, so this is the wig on my head. Oh, it's actually really, really pretty, y'all. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is so pretty, and it feels like, like my scalp can actually breathe. You know how when you get the wigs, like the lace wigs, and you have like the tracks, and then you can just like, so you know it's on your head, but this feels like so free. Uh, I'm nervous, because if I get in water and this thing come off, I'm supposed to know that it came off, because you can barely feel it on your head. But, look at this. Let me turn around so you guys can see from the back. But, like, ah, just standing up, it's, like, all the way down, like, to my butt. Like, I don't think this is 18 inches, y'all. I think this is, like, 20-something. Like, this, this ain't no 18 inch. <laughs> like, look at this. Oh, it's so pretty. Like literally, guys, look at this. Like this, my my L's ashy ball. Jeez, look at that. I don't know. Love me here. I don't know if y'all gave me some extra inches or what, but I'm gonna take it, sis. I'm gonna take it. But this is really pretty so far. I don't know what it is, but I'm actually loving this full lace wig. It just feels so free. But let me get a little closer so you guys can see. Like, look at that. I'm going to try to keep making a part. Like, you can literally do a part all the way down the middle and not have any kind of issues. It's just... Either way, like, the hairline is really pretty. Like, look at that. Like, you don't really have to do much to it, to be honest. Like, it's a pretty nice hairline if you need like a quick wig that you don't know how to work with I think this is really it to be honest with you I will personally customize it and I will do a lot of other like plucking and stuff like that of course I gotta bleach my knots and all that good stuff but rather than that if you don't know what you're doing this wig is perfect to be honest let me show you guys the back Like, the hair feels really good. And excuse my luggage over here. I'm packing for a vacation, so it's a little messy back there in the corner. Because all my clothes is, like, on top of my luggage. But, look at this. I don't know. I'm low-key feeling this wig, y'all. Oh, my God. This is so pretty. Like, look at the sides. And it's just nice and shiny and silky. 
Oh, I'm about to be on vacation killing again. Y'all ain't about to tell me nothing. If y'all don't follow me on Instagram, y'all needs to follow me now because your girl is about to be killing the game. I'm telling you. Like, this wig is about to get put to every single test that it can be tested on. Because, sis, like, look at this. It's, uh, let's try it with a comb and see what the parts look like. And pull it down because my lace. One thing I'm just trying to figure out, too, while I have it on my head is, like, how do I know where to put it at? Right, because there's lace everywhere. So I need to like make sure that it lines up on my head. I don't know, I'm gonna figure it out somehow. But, look at that. There's just the middle part. I'm trying to part it down the middle so you guys can see. I'm not sure if I'm going to get an even part. I can't even do an even part in my own head when I try to braid it. So I don't know how the heck I'm going to do it with this wig on my head. But I think that's good enough. So you guys can see. It's literally lace everywhere. <laughs> I love this wig already. Like, I don't have any cons to say. Let's see if it sheds. Rub my fingers through it just a little bit. So it does shed a little bit. I haven't washed it yet. This is just out the box. And so I'm going to show you guys what I have in my hands if I can get it all. But I think any wig. I haven't had a wig that hasn't shed. I don't know if I'm just buying unworthy wigs. But this is what I've got right here. It's like about four or five strings of just rubbing my Look at my hands. My hands are so ashy out. Like this corn, like this coronavirus stuff, I have to always put hand sanitizer on my hands and lotion them, hand sanitizer, lotion them. Like, it just be too much. Like, my skin's literally drying out. But, anywho, this is like four or five strings of hair right here. So, it's not too bad. Like I said, I, any wig that I get sheds, I think it's just normal, to be honest. Like, if you guys have a shed free wig, let me know because I never had one, ever. Like, I always get shedding hair in there. I did have some bad wigs where it shed a lot. But, I haven't had any that's like, doesn't shed at all, you know. I like the minimum. I can deal with the minimum shedding, but just shedding every single second, I can't deal with it. So, this so far is not too bad when it comes to the shedding at all. Here's a little more. And also, too, I don't know if a full lace wig sheds more than an average because it, it doesn't have any lace on it. So maybe that's the case. I'm not too sure. Like I said, I never had a full lace wig. So I couldn't really tell you. So I don't know. Shedding is not too bad to me, I feel. But I still have to wash it and bleach it. So we'll see how that goes. But so far, so good, y'all. Like, I'm, I feel like I can go outside with my wig looking just like this, lace and all. And still slay the game. But... I don't know. I like this wig a lot, y'all. Hopefully, everything still continues. I do have, like, all my bleach and stuff that I'm about to work on doing this wig sometime this week. Alright, so that's really it for this wig. So far, it looks amazing. Like, I'm so soaked about putting this wig on and, like, customizing it and getting it slayed for vacation. I will be doing a follow-up about three weeks after having this wig. About three weeks to a month after having this wig. So, if you guys... Want to see a follow-up? Make sure you subscribe down below. If you do have this wig and you like it, like I said, let me know in the comments. I would like to know if you guys want to see me customize this wig, pre-pluck it, get it the whole 360 full lace thing going on. Let me know and my voice is starting to sound <clears throat> very horsey. <laughs> but let me know in the comments down below. Rather than that, that is it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys next time.